Welcome back to the channel. We're playing Rift Breaker. I almost said Satisfactory. Honestly, I kind of wish we were playing Satisfactory, but I do play a lot of that. Um, and last episode, we did a headquarters upgrade. A lot of shit started popping off. Oop, probably shouldn't be shooting my own buildings. Uh, where's my headquarters again? It's down this way. And uh, we're working through our tech tree. A couple of additional things here. So headquarters level four. Oh, that allows me to maybe upgrade to level four. Okay. Alien research after that. And that lets me move on with that tree. But what we're going to do today is I'm thinking we extend the wall all the way up this way, all the way down this way. And then we just take all of that. Maybe that's a lot to ask for, but oh well. Oh, well, let's repair some stuff here. Not doing too great. And that little group's eliminated. We should have eliminated the majority of the enemies in this area, so... Okay, I guess we'll go around this. Don't know how we missed this group. They can't get in the mud for some reason. Do they take more damage if they don't have... Hmm. If they don't have that ball on them? Or maybe it's just that they take two regardless and I got some good hits on some of them. Okay, thank you. Where are these enemies coming from? I feel like we absolutely cleared a lot of this out. That's okay though. We're gonna continue our line. All the way down. But legitimately though, right? Like, didn't I care? Enemies respawn like that. Mm. Alright, let's go around this carbonium deposit so we can actually use it and incorporate it into our base. Okay, so that's the bottom of the map. So I know this is excessive. But, like, if you don't build excessive in games like this, like, are you really playing them, you know? Like, if the entire map isn't your base at some point, then what's the point? I like that with RTS games as well, when I would play StarCraft, like... Oh, if I don't control all the resource nodes in the game, then did I really even play? Base is under attack. Yeah, it's under attack because of... That's my base now. There is a breach in our wall. Okay, it is actually annoying that 
I'm running into new enemies. Maybe these are just like little pockets that I haven't discovered yet. Let me know in the comments if that's what you're seeing. Or am I just crazy? Because like, how did I miss all of these groups of en enemies? It is easy to find the edge of the map, I guess, right? If you just basically say, I'm going to build a wall all the way up to the legal limit. Oof, that save game. I would change the frequency. I think you can, but I also am afraid it's just going to crash. So I don't want to risk that. I will Oh, is it? But what if I don't care, game? We're not going to power all these yet. For one, we don't actually have the power for the AI cores for all of these. Okay, I know damn well I just walked past here. So... A new technology has been okay, new technologies there. Maybe we can... Oh, energy storage mark two. Wait. Yes, add to research, okay. Oh, and then new wind turbines and stuff? Okay, that's cool. Can I just say add it all like, what am I going to say no to something? Armory level 2. Harvesting station cultivator. These drones operated buildings are used to grow and cultivate saplings, a species of local flora. Ooh. Efficiency of lab. Okay. That's about all I can do right now, I think. I research that, I should be able to research everything. Okay. At, par at parts where there's like a little bit of a break, we'll add a little bit additional support. Like right here, you know, maybe I just do two on the corners. Like that. So we have like a little bit of a thing. I should put teleporters all over the place as well. We'll go back and do that. Not enough AI cores. Oh, Build so we had AI enough cores. until just now. Okay, you know what I'm going to do? There's like this little alcove right here. How's that carbonium storage coming along? Not enough AI cores. Build Not more AI, AI hubs. Cores. Build more AI hubs. Oh, do those need to be on the power grid? So what if we just do like a... Uh, There. That should Connect help some shortages. of those. Connect more power plants. Yeah, does that help? Can 
Why did that one take like especially long? Is it because, oh, the local grid. Okay, so we are, yeah, we still don't have enough. That's okay though. Oh my gosh, did we make these for all of these batteries? No, wind turbine. Wait, are all these wind turbines? No, that's what we have selected. What is, oh, energy storage? I'm an idiot. Like, Yep, these are wind turbines. And then we can do like... There, that should help a little bit. So, of course, wind is low. Everything is low right now. Oh, goodness. Alright, well, some of them are lit up. Means we can put down additional towers. And this fog is wild, though. The gym makes it really difficult to see. Protect the corners. That one's up by one. Alright, for those of you that are watching my Satisfactory series, let me tell you how much I love that game. <laughs> it's it's unbelievable. I that is legitimately one of my favorite games of all time. So if you're not watching that series, go out there and, and fix that, because it's so... I don't know. I'm enjoying myself playing that game. Playing it a little bit different than I normally would. And, spoiler, at the time of recording this, uh, there's... It actually is going to line up pretty well. There's... Super close starts to us shifting over and building a mega factory. That's what we're building right in that playthrough right now. It's just a mini base. A starter base, you know? I see enemies like sitting right outside of our base somehow. Like we haven't walked by that area. A bunch. Ah, just little guys. Let's get this little clump, or this little one, or two dudes right here. Yep, looks like much smaller than on the map. Okay, and what we're gonna do... Oh, hey guys. What you doing over here? where one of those egg things was. Uh, we can't explore that because it's a big rock. We've got a geothermal vent there, which seems like you have to vent out water or mud or something out of it. Which I don't know what you do. 
with the excess. Now let's place another one right there. I look at corners as like the vulnerable parts of the base, hence the additional turrets in those corners. Like it always feels like they're attacking a corner. That looks like an enemy right there. Yeah. Told me to build all that storage. Maybe I should have listened. How much does it take? A hundred? Oh, and of course, I would misalign that. Come on, SV. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We gotta, we gotta set some of this stuff up. We have Mark II's? No, maybe a Mark II is just... Oh, gas filtering. Okay, interesting. Maybe a Mark II is just an upgradable piece, like you could just... Um, like click the building and upgrade it to the next level? I'm not sure how the additional stuff works like that. Yeah, mine some additional carbonium for me. stuff on these carbonium deposits since we're walking around. And we'll connect these two grids together, but expand on both. I don't know how many it takes for one one pump, so we're just gonna overkill it. Better to have more than to have less, and we for sure are not gonna be able to power all of... Oh, an incoming attack, you say? From where? Up here? Up here? Look at these groups just sitting down here. That's just annoying, isn't it? Do this. Let's preemptively just start getting some power to some of this stuff. Not enough plant biomass. And are we going to pave over this entire area? You damn. Well, know it. Ironium storage is full. Build more storage facilities. No, not Ironium ones. I don't think it actually matters. I think it all. A new technology has been developed. Just works new together. Are available for construction. Do we have enough power for this? Is this for real? 
Or do you just need to power AI cores and that's all that matters? Wild that you can just do this. It is cool, though. And all this area means we move faster in it later. So, it is a good thing to do. It, it uses a lot of carbonium, but actually we're making basically just as much. Uh, we're under attack though. Pop over here right quick. Pop this side out. There's a lot more of these bigger guys coming in. Did we lose a single wall segment even? Not enough AI cores. Build more AI hubs. Not a single wall segment lost, ladies and gentlemen. Why is because power is not at all there. Not enough AI cores. Build more AI hubs. Yeah. So now we get to the part where I made a mistake, you know? And we need carbonium. Or we need like a gust of wind or some shit. Gives me time to have a drink. How many power plants do I want? Oh, we can do a carbonium power plant. Yeah, we'll do like three of those. That'll be good. We don't need all of the carbonium all the time, just for building. We could use some of it for for non-building. Not enough carbonium. I think those should give off kind of a lot. on the local grid, but are we getting carbonium? Very, very slowly. So let's get a whole bunch more. Oh no, there's our carbonium, but still it's going up slowly. Power, we're gonna get three more. We'll put them on this node. It looks like it's going up a little faster now because probably it's getting sunny out. Yeah, so the solar panels are actually working. It is a cool mechanic that you have to do these trade-offs like that, but it's also, I don't know, is that fun?
I always think about that. Like, is it fun to do stuff like that? Yeah, I should do a geothermo. No, that's gas. Geothermo power plant, this one. But what happens with the mud? Okay, so the mud comes out, and and then what? Like, you filter it into water, or what? Gas filtering, water filtering. Reduces flammable gas out of plant biomass. Okay, so that'd be for like flamethrower stuff. Gas filtering plant. Yeah, water filtering plant. I don't understand. Okay, and then what? Then it goes into liquid storage? And then what do we use that for? Also, I don't feel like it's super clear when something is lining up. Is it just strictly the arrows? I don't know what what else you're supposed to do there. Maybe there's like another thing that you eventually use. Water for that's that makes a little bit more sense. I don't understand. All right, let's continue our towers along the side here. So we were doing quite well. Deposit depleted. Oh, okay, so you can override something like that. That's interesting. I did not expect that. Warning! Hostile creatures are coming from a nearby nest. Should go there and clear it out. No, I see it up there, the top right. Okay, we'll get up there soon. Race is under attack. Fine, let's go there now. Oh wow, is there a wall piece destroyed? need more <laughs> escape routes. Alright, let's go get this damn base. That expansion though, like, we are expanding drastically. Holy F. Look at this guy. Or is or maybe it's just not yeah that's like not an enemy it's a base okay got it 
that biomass. Yeah, let's slow that base down, you know? Like, I don't know if it's supposed to... What am I supposed to do? How do I... Let, let's go to C. Oh, controls. Okay. Spaces interact. I don't understand. What about the scanner? Add that to the research queue. So, if we have a scanner equipped, which I believe we do, what are my mods? Target piercing, homing projectiles, range plus 16%. Projectile properties, okay. We don't have additional skills. Where would the scanner be? Is it just one of the things we unlocked in the tech tree? Yeah, it's probably here. Oh, radar pulse, maybe that's it? Just a moment, no. The dodge roll, that's not it. I've seen, like, people dig stuff up. What's in here? The water filtering pipe. Still, I don't know what you do with water filtering. Lab, a bio scanner, maybe that. Yeah, so the bio scanner allows you to obtain these samples. Okay. Do I just have to be in the right position? Oh, okay. That's what it was. I had to be in the right position for it. Oh, look at that. That was cool. I did not expect that to be a thing. Alright, let's scan some more stuff while we're walking around. Bio deposit depleted. Uh, F is happening. Okay, so random act that just says, fuck it, we're going to destroy everything around you. That's weird. I know you can do like repair towers and stuff, but like... Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Their game, and it seemed to be centralized to where I was. Perhaps. Uh, Mr. Our carbonium going back up, yeah. So let's add another carbonium power plane situation here.
And then we're going to just add that to the grid. And then maybe we'll just go up from this side. Yeah, we'll just take, well here, F it, let's just take this also. I'm gonna do it, might as well do it, right? Dictates I can and can't put a portal down. I don't get it. What are these? Artillery tower, okay. Sentinel tower, rocket tower. Oh yeah, we need... Yeah, that's okay. More AI cores, would you say, game? Do we need more AI cores? just we're gonna keep going with the additional uh, what do I want like that I want to keep going with the additional power plants like that until we get a good con control on a large part of our power Why? Might I ask? Now, do we need something for that to work? Not a repair. Communication sub, no lab. Rift magnetic stabilizer. I don't know if we have one of those. Armory. Okay, so maybe we need to upgrade our armory. Let's go and find out. Is this our armory? Nope. Oh, always hitting the wrong button. Yeah, that is our armory. Construct the alien research laboratory building. Do we have access to that? Is it just the laboratory or do we already have one of those? Carbonium deposit right. Develop technologies based on extraterrestrial. Yeah, okay, so this must be it. Okay, this is the one that takes water. So we do have this one here somewhere. Or not. No, we have that one. Okay, so let's just put this here. And hopefully... 
That'll work. I have no idea. Like you call it an alien laboratory, but then in the thing it just says laboratory. Uh, no biomass. Okay. I'm like, what does that thing say? All right, let's go get some then. Maybe we find something on the way too. Okay, got that little red blotch out of there. Build a tower ammunition factory to supply your towers. Okay, so maybe I don't actually have access to that yet. Maybe that's like somewhere in my long research queue. I say that looked like something right there. I like that you could just like uncover nodes, additional nodes like that. I guess the benefit of having enemies respawning all the time is you can just farm them for biomass. It's like one way to look at it, I guess. But at some point, we would cause this entire species to be extinct. Let's be real. Huh? We're not going to reproduce fast enough if I'm killing them by the thousand. Like, one person kills... I mean, how many thousands have I already killed? Bad time to take a sip of a drink. All right, is this a rock? Nope. Well, it, it, yeah. <laughs> actually, the answer is yes. It is a rock. It's not the one I was thinking. So I think what we're going to do is uh, survive this attack, because it's likely that we will. Connect a water fil filtering plant. What? Alright, where is... Oh. Should really be paying attention to my surroundings. Although, legitimately, did not look like there were any enemies there, so... Really, is it my fault or is it the game's fault? Yeah, these enemies are appearing literally out of thin air. So they're coming directly from the spots that I was in. I can lead them back to my base, but like, I think I could actually handle this. Oh, what's that green thing? Is it because I'm killing stuff that I now can do additional research on some of these units? Okay, this is like an actually decent sized attack. So yeah, let's take them to our base. So if anyone tells me the spear is not overpowered, I mean, you're a damn liar, because look at that. Okay, let's go see what the F that green thing was. It dropped somewhere up this way. We'll follow the trail of blood. Build a tower ammunition thing, yep. 
Did it tell me what it was? Oh, new species discovered. Oh, how do I how do I check that? How do I... I just do that? No. How do I research that? I don't even know. How do I research that? I want to know. Oh, like some of them glow green. And maybe when I kill that one? No. Okay, it's not tab. We're just going to press buttons until we find it. And there's a lot of them. Oh, P, okay. F, no, obviously not. I should have known that. G, no. H, V, no. Z, X, no. What about tilde? No. N. N M no No, I don't know. Okay, they're they're literally saying, hey, maybe it's time for you to go to a different planet. Oh look at how what am I supposed to do about this? Maybe I don't have the thing unlocked yet. Okay, so that somehow maybe scanned it? Oh yeah, maybe I don't have it. Okay, a research station. Let's get that. Did I get... This? How do I... There's about one million and one things in here. A bio... Okay, yeah, so I got the bio scanner, but is there something else that I'm missing that allows me to do alien research? So... Is mine the detector or bio scanner? That looks like... Maybe that looks like the detector. So maybe I have to equip a bio scanner or like craft it. Nitro radar pulse, titanium machinery, mm. energy sensors. What does this do? Set of passive upgrades for Mr. Riggs improves various parameters when inserted one of the, um, okay. Mod drop rate, 20%. Re research drop rate, plus 20%. That actually sounds really good. Let's, let's get one of those at least. Um, because additional percentage is always nice, right? Okay, so if it's not there... Doesn't look like it's under mods. It's not, I would imagine, a weapon. No. So it seems like it would just be an ability. Movement skills normal. Gonna go through it one more time, really quick. Hmm. I don't know. Well, anyway, let me know in the comments if you know what that means. How do we do it? I I have no idea. But we'll pick it up in the next video. Thanks so much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the series. As always, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Catch you in the next one.